been an Olympic champion, I've been a European world, but never been an Olympic champion, so I want this title. I'm still losing in the first mark, I'm still losing the jumps, so I have to work more on my jumps and on stability. She said to me once that the people who fight till the end, they anyway, they're gonna win. Coming onto the ice, the 21 year old from St. Petersburg. Alexei Yagudin, fifth in the 98 Olympics. He's never won a Russian national title. He's been second four years in a row. Here's his chance to win an Olympic gold medal. The man in the iron mask. It's his quad, his triple toe double loop. Triple Axel. Salco. Such wonderful flow on all of his jumps. And the loop. some steps and some expression. Triple flip.
magnificent steps. A spin remaining. Sixes. Surely a gold medal performance from Alexi Yagudin. Three times a world champion, he's won just about everything. Now he can take the greatest prize of all. And he's got this American strong crowd, 15,000 fans, eating out of his hand. Now he started this magnificently crafted program out with this quad toe. And look at the flow as it carries across the ice into the triple toe. And we're going towards the boards, but he's not over yet. There's the double loop. Kloshenko did it last world, and Yagudin has perfected it. And he really could have stopped there with the quads, but no, he had another go and he did the quad toe by itself, the opposing corner of the rink. Still focused and he was still controlled. All of his jumps flew across the ice tonight. Tatiana holds her breath. Yagudin holds his breath. across the board for technical merit. This could be a special moment for Tatiana. She coached Ilya Kulik in Nagano in 98. Yagudin has won the goal. A mighty comeback. Sixes for sure. Soviet athletes have now won the last four gold medals in men's figure skating. Viktor Petrenko at Albertville in 92, Alexei Amanov in Lillehammer in 94, and Ilya Kulik four years ago in Nagano. And now, Alexei Yagudin. Thank you.